guys welcome back to my channel so what we're gonna be doing is trying out a concealer today and I got this concealer from pure and buzz agent they sent it over it is the four-in-one sculpting concealer with skincare ingredients this concealer retails for $22 this is what it says it says four-in-one sculpting concealer helps to cover imperfections brighten and renew the appearance of skin with encapsulated retinol and antioxidant rich superfoods so the benefits are it is a medium to full concealer coverage with lightweight feel and second skin finish which is great they have 16 concealer shades which is also very good covers brightens plumps and corrects it's a naturally moisturizing concealer formula that adapts to multiple skin tones and textures skincare infused concealer formula helps to reduce the appearance of blemishes redness fine lines and wrinkles uneven skin tone and hyperpigmentation and it also says that it blends out seamlessly helps to cover the look of imperfections while brightening the appearance of the under eye area so the key ingredients are serotonin complex sodium hyaluronate energy complex superfood blend and caffeine and the superfood blend says it's enriched with turmeric and elderberry fruit extract to aid in a brighter and more radiant looking appearance that sounds really good all right so if you guys want 20 percent off on purecosmetics.com use review 20 at checkout all right and they're clean vegan and cruelty free so this is the little package it says push up four in one sculpting concealer Mine is in the shade MG2. All right, so mine is in the shade Bisque Light Golden Medium Skin with Golden Undertones, which I don't know if that was the right tone. I feel like I should have gotten Medium Skin with Neutral Undertones, which is, which is MN3. I hope this doesn't seem like yellow on me, but it doesn't look like it. All right, so you push up this little thing here, which is nice. And then this is your dope foot applicator. I like it so far. The concealer seems soft, so let's try to apply this and see. What do you guys think? Do you see a difference between one eye and the other? I see a slight difference. Definitely like a nice, you know, it has good coverage. It seems like it has nice coverage. I can definitely see the difference between the two eyes. Can you guys tell? I can see like a little bit of, I guess, lifting as well here. Um, I don't know about like the little under eye wrinkles that we get here. I don't know if it's like setting into those lines or not. Let me know what you guys see. It's very creamy and a tad bit tacky. It's not too tacky. It's just a little bit, but it is very creamy. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I feel like it blended nicer on this eye than it did on this one, but it's not that big of a deal. I definitely like the coverage. It It's definitely a medium to full. Um, it's buildable to a full for sure. I do like the covers. Let me know what you guys think. I think it looks pretty good. It looks nice. What do you guys think about it? I like it. Um... I'm thinking I should probably set it. Should I set it? Let's set it with um, my Alomar Cosmetics. But yeah, I definitely like it. I'm always scared about setting my under eyes because I always feel like it's gonna settle in the lines, but they say that's what we should do, so we've got to do it. All right, guys, this is the last look at the concealer. Oh, I'm not going to be able to do like a full day wear test because I'm actually filming this at 9 o'clock at night. So this is probably not going to be on my face for 
another hour or maybe it'll be on my face for an hour or two max it's not going to be on my face for a long time so yeah guys i love you guys let me know what you thought of this conceal this is a pretty short video i mean <laughs> you know what can we say this is a first impression of the pure push-up four-in-one sculpting concealer i definitely like it so far i my first impression is good i like the coverage let me know what you guys see if you guys have tried this concealer let me know how it went for you if you liked it what were your thoughts on it i love you guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye my loves <laughs>